legal team representing former Interior Cabinet Secretary Fred Matiangi has dismissed claims that Matiangi was ordered to appear before the DCI on Friday to clarify the alleged raid at his home early this month. Led by lawyer Dunstan Omari, the team says Matiangi has not received any formal directive to appear before the DCI for grilling even as he confirmed the former CS is doing well. Phoebe Wangombe now reports. For the better part of Thursday, information was rife in the media that Dr. Fred Matiangi had been summoned to appear before the intelligence agency DCI to record a statement in respect with his statement that police had raided his home. Come Friday morning, the DCI headquarters in Kiambu remained quiet as Dr. Fred Matiangi failed to show up. His legal team, led by Danston Omari, will later in the day address the media dismissing claims that Dr. Matiangi was supposed to appear before the DCI. Omari termed such claims as pure rumors revealing his client had no knowledge of a formal summon from the directorate. A proper summon under the National Police Service Act must be signed and witnessed by police officers. Show me one where the police have signed, similar to mine, where there were three signatures of police officers. Two, a summon must be served in person to the person it is targeted. Show me a summon that has been served to Dr. Fred Matiang, and he has put a signature there, or his advocate has put a signature there, or his wife has put a signature there, or his worker has put a signature there. Omari and his team insisting that the law is clear regarding the process of issuing summons and that investigative agencies must adhere to such laws. The court order from the High Court does not stop the CS from being investigated. He has nothing to hide. But the investigation must be done within the law. Dr. Fred Matiangi has found himself at crossroads with the security department and has been on the trail of DCI, which remains convinced Dr. Matiangi fabricated a story of police raid at his premises. You can see the new DCI, his mode of operation. A complete departure that proves completely somebody incompetent, somebody who doesn't know how the law is to be applied in service of summons. So, my client, when he will be served within the law, he will be the first one to appear before any investigative agency in this country. So any narrative to show Dr. Matiangi as somebody who is not ready to comply with the police is politics, is hot air, from the DCI and that is why we have put it to the attention of the whole country that show us where the service is and show us a summon that has been signed. The appointment of Mr. Mohammed Amin as the DCI was done as the law so requires. So it is our expectation that everything that he will do, he will do so as and in accordance with the law. If he continues failing to respect and obey the law or obeying the law, then we will be forced to use the very mechanisms that have set him in that office to have him removed from that office. Lawyers representing former Interior CS Dr. Fred Matiangi have said that Matiangi is ready to appear before any investigative agencies as long as the summons made in regards to the investigations are done within the law. Reporting for Lookup TV, Phoebe Wangombe, Nairobi.